okay lost the die roll I think I have to keep this although it does not have any green sauce uh, I still can you know turn one uh, death right and he play a fetch land then I can you know use the death right to make a bird and uh, use the watery grave to inquisition him oh what a fetch land the sickest fetch land ever hopefully I'm not playing a fun deck uh, but <laughs> when you see this land is probably a fun deck oh my god it's, it's a red deck win with terramorphic expense it's a very budget red deck win I guess uh, we will know after seeing his hand I think I'll take the Lava Mancer. I'll be down to 9 after his attack. Oh, down to 6. Soon. Let's draw a land and cast the bird and let him board it. Okay, I, I hope he board the Death Rack. But at least we know the you know the combo of uh, Umbrella Rise plus Ayuna will shut him down because he's playing red, uh, mono red. So you know actually I think we'll be fine. Inquisition, he got a boat and something else. Let's take it. Ooh, he F six. I just saved three damage. I just saved three damage. Did you see that? Shark for this. Come on, give me a land, man. Give me a forest. Oh. I think I have to, you know, just kill that dude now. So he's saving on the fetches. Well, I think I can shut him down for good now. Okay, that is the last hit I'm going to take. Definitely. Perhaps even he play fetches, he, he will be still the same because of his draws. And uh, yeah. And of course his response. You know he F6 the lightning bolt and the uh, reef bolt killing my death right shaman. So maybe it's bad. Uh, maybe he will think uh turn out differently. Maybe he's scared that you know I can gain some life with the Grim Lava Mancer. Uh, I mean the Death Right Shaman. So maybe he did his best. Because with Death Right, I can actually uh, combo out earlier. So, yeah. So, I guess I won this. With some spare change, kitchen flings, and the birds, they are never cast. Come on, click something. Oh, you see, it's a nice move. Yeah, I know. I don't think he can cast anything except artifact now. Yeah. And he concede, which is uh, logical. So maybe he got some hit in the form of uh, maybe graph digger cage. Maybe I'm not so sure. Maybe cut, maybe cut some cuts. I don't 
don't think we need rough. I think we need nature's clay, we need uh, spell sky, we need uh, uh, you know, worm coin, battle skull, uh, cut a sun titan, I don't need, you know, the, I don't need the, the recurrence. Okay, pretty bad hand. Mulligan, yes, of course. Ooh! Five lands, one inquisition. Quite a sick hand. So it's like, you know, giving a chance to him. Well, ooh! Okay, let's get a green. Green. A bird. You know, uh, maybe this will be barbecue bird. Searing spear? No. Ooh, two times coming guy. Ooh, disgusting. That's seven damage, man. I'm down to ten. Then he attack, I'm down to. Whoa, nature's claim. Not much use. Back. Uh, lava Mensa or Skull Crack? I think Lava Mensa. I think Skull. Oh, don't know Lee. I think Skull Crack. I still can gain some life with the uh, Nature's Claim. So let's see what he helped me flip over. Because I might just concede over there. Oh. I can claim that. <laughs> wow, uh, so I block, take five, take seven. I even I gain four life, I'll be dead. Oh no, very bad, very bad. He got two combing guys on the first turn, and I'm actually very bad. Uh, yeah, I think this is good. This is better than rough. And, uh, I need to cut one. Uh, probably the the source. Would you like to play first? Yes. This is a very bad hand. This is also very bad. But I guess I will keep this. If my bird survive, then I think I have a very good chance because I have the life from the loom. So I can actually... Uh, do some uh, chaining up of fetches. Okay, that is very good. Okay, I got another land too. But I'm going to fetch this into black. Just black. I can, you know, uh, gain 2 life from the Spark Elemental. Uh, hopefully he doesn't kill the death, right? Oh, he did. That is sick. Slowly but surely, taking some damage from the fetches. I can randomly hit uh, Umbrella Rice and Iona, which I didn't. 
I have to like you know keep fetching to team my deck. I'll get a blue white this time. I should actually tap the bird for mana because if he kill the bird then it's actually very bad. Okay, Goblin Guide is good. Another one is not so good. So I'm uh, going to take two. But depends on what I draw. Oh, 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 oh. I will gladly draw that. Black, green. Okay, I am going to draw the fire and ice. No. I'm down to eight, which is uh, very uh, <laughs> you know, uh, very life threatening. I would actually rather have a uh, light and shadow, but you can't really complain much, you know. Let's draw something good. Uh, no, I'm not going to dredge. Oh no, I regret. So I have 6 mana, I just need to, you know, play 3 more lands and cast my Iona. Oh, it's a relic. Ooh. Okay, I do not need a bird. No, I do not like to dredge. I like to draw lots of cards. Ooh. I can do the spell sky. Just track sometimes, just delay. Oh, he just target spell sky straight, which is good. Don't need me to spend mana. It's good. Searing base for one. The fuck? <laughs> okay. I am going to play very carefully. Actually, I should attack with both. That will be like. Okay, anyway, it's five damage also. It's a worm coil like how I I think I'd rather be safe, right? Why? And uh play a fetch land. Get a white uh so that next turn I can cast Iona. So he has two mana available. I don't think two mana can kill me with my spell sky in play. Skull crack. Uh, okay. He fetch, okay. I think he's dead with my sword. I can give him a decay. So Iona in hand is actually quite bad, so I will consider putting in uh, Liliana out of view. So no reason to fetch there, but uh, no, it's just a routine fetch.
just kill him okay and I won Monorail